continue. Hello, dearest. Welcome back to my channel. This is Marfeli. I am glad to be with you all once again as I share with you one of my healthiest drinks that I usually make in winter. This healthy drink relax muscles, relieve pains, calms you down, boosts your immune system, prevents cold and flu, and has many other health benefits that we cannot mention all. So join me, relax, whilst I take you through the process step by step. So let's get started. Here I have my nicely washed and clean oranges. I will leave everything in the description box for you all. What I usually do is to wash them twice and on the second wash, I wash with salt, making sure that it is very clean and nice. And once I am done, the next thing to do is to cut my oranges into two. Now, if you are new to my channel, we will be delighted to have you join us by subscribing to our YouTube channel, adding on the bell so that you will not miss out on any upload that I make. Share and also leave your comments in the comment section. So once I am done cutting them, the next thing is to do the squeezing and this time around i'm going to squeeze them using the food processor and if you do not have the food processor you can still use the manual squeezing cup i usually use the manual one if i'm not making a lot but because i'm going to make a lot of them that is why i am using the food processor to make it a bit quicker and snappy so I will keep on squeezing them until it becomes full and once it becomes full I will move to the next process. Continental Food Mistress International Food Madam So as you can see I have squeezed most of my oranges and it is full so I'm going to take out the chaff and then strain it nicely. The straining part is optional but I like to strain it. If you do not want to strain, don't strain. But I like to strain it to make sure that it is very smooth and nice. So I'm going to strain the juice very nicely as you can see me doing it there. And then repeat the same process, squeezing the remaining. I will leave all the ingredients that I'm using in the description box and then the measurement, the amount that I'm using with each of them so that it will help you to make this healthy and super tasty drink at home. So once I am done straining them, the next thing is to discard the chaff and then move to the next process. Next, I'm going to add my nicely peeled, washed and cut ginger into the blender add water to it and blend into a smoother consistency here what we are going to do is to make ginger and honey syrup so once i am done blending i will show you the next process next i'm going to Pour the blended ginger into the strainer and strain out the juice into the orange juice very nicely, making sure that it is very, very nice and perfect. And we are going to use the chaff to make our honey and ginger syrup. Did you think I was going to throw them away? Mm -mm. No, not in my Felis kitchen. In my Felis kitchen, we do not waste anything. Nothing goes to waste at all <laughs> and once i am done straining the ginger next i'm going to transfer the chaff into the pot nicely continental food mistress international food madam Next, I will rinse the strainer with water and also rinse the blender with water. I'm going to leave the amount of water that I'm using to make the ginger syrup in the description box as well. So please do not forget to check the description box for everything that I'm going to use, okay? So once I'm done, next I'm going to 
transfer it on the fire and bring to a boil for five minutes and this is five minutes later and just look at the way it look it is so nice and perfect so at this point i'm going to take it out of the fire and transfer it into the strainer in a cup make sure that the cup that you are using is heat resistant or you may use any bowl that you know that when you pour something hot inside it's not going to break okay we do not want to enjoy our drink having pieces of glasses in our mouth or in our stomach so i'm making sure to strain out all the syrup out of it very nicely and discard the chaff and at this point i'm going to go ahead and add my honey to it nicely once i'm done adding the honey to it next i'm going to stir everything together until it is well incorporated kitchen the best once it is well incorporated next i'm going to transfer it into the juice nicely gradually you can see my bowl is full but i'm going to add everything later so make sure that you are using a bigger bowl enough or the amount that you are making that i'm going to leave on the description box is going to fit the bowl that you are using so i'm going to stir everything together until the ginger honey and the orange juice are well incorporated and for the honey you can add more to your preference and if you do not have the honey you can use brown sugar as well and then once i am done i'm going to add my apple cider vinegar as you saw it i added apple cider vinegar to it and stir everything together until it is well combined and incorporated very well and once everything is well incorporated that means our drink is ready and at this point you can bottle them nicely just like the way you see me doing it and keep them in the refrigerator and enjoy with your family you can serve this cold or hot and get a lot and lot of health benefits and as you can see i made a lot and sam is going to one of my respectable friends thank you all so much for watching and i believe you enjoyed this video until now if you did enjoy me until now i do thank you so much and i believe you are inspired to try this and give me the feedback in the comment section and if you have not subscribed yet please do subscribe turn on the bell so that you will not miss out in any upload that i make if you're a new subscriber welcome to my channel this is mafeli thank you for subscribing and always remember at mafeli we believe in the old adage your health is your world so be mindful of what you eat and until i see you in my next video stay safe fit and healthy bye